Hey guys, this is Anthony. Um, I'm going to be giving a quick tutorial on what the Warlight is, how it's used, what its purposes are, and how it affects the matches that you get. On the site, we use a match finder, or you can challenge teams, just like game battles. And to obviously use it for a second, you'll know how it works. But there's also another way that you can kind of control who you're playing, and that's by editing your Warlight. The Warlight is kind of like a symbol to let other teams know we're accepting challenges, send us a challenge, whatever, without you having to go out and find them yourselves. So, let's just go to ladder so you can see what I mean. Uh, we'll go to the doubles ladder, and you will see my team, Doom. If you click, the Warlight is off. It has an X on it. That means that, uh, it means that Basically, I'm not accepting challenges right now. Let's say that I wanted to accept a challenge, but I don't want to go on the match finder because you get matched up with, an, with anonymous teams. Let's say you're a first page team. You only want to play you know, top 10 teams on the ladder, but you don't want to send out challenges because you don't know who's on when. You go into My Teams. You go to the team that you want to edit, Edit Team in Warlight. And where it says Status, enable this if you want to play matches. I'm sorry, that's not it, actually. Um... You go to Warlight status. Looking for a quick match? Yes. It'll let other teams know who look at the page, hey, I'm accepting a challenge. You know, if I want to put it for one hour, war details, uh, you know, three maps, execution, MLG variant, whatever. Update team. And when you go to the ladders. Go to doubles, you'll see that as soon as this finishes loading, you see the warlight is on. It says it says that I'm even looking for a battle. Uh three maps of it'll tell you what my details are that I want. You know, if you find yourself at the top of the ladder or even in the middle of the ladder and you don't want to play top teams, it's a good way to let other teams out there know we're accepting challenges, you know, send us one. You never know what you'll get. You know, you could you could be the top ranked team on the ladder and get a chance to play the second ranked team on the ladder because they're looking for a match too. So use it to your advantage. This has been a quick tutorial on it. If you have any other questions regarding it or if you have any bugs regarding it, make sure to contact a staff member.